Hi, the owners of this business, Speedy Auto Tint, hired an artist to paint this mural that you see right behind me. Now, some of the faces on it are uh, Vin Scully, Kobe, Snoop Dogg, Tupac, Oscar De La Hoya, Danny Trejo. They say it took about a month and a half to create, and now that it's done, they may be forced to take it down, but they say they've received positive feedback. One woman we spoke with teared up when she saw it. This means a lot to you. It does. Today's today's climate bothers me so any little bit of beauty is a good thing so you say keep it keep it keep it it's worth it you know everyone loves Vince Coley everyone loves Kobe Bryant if you're from LA you know what's going on with this mural you know the unity it brings the best thing that happened to Bellflower it just we don't want to take it down they put so much work into it but the owners have run into a problem. The mural faces Woodruff Avenue and Bellflower Municipal Code requires that painted murals face side streets. A permit is also required. The owners shared this on social media and started a petition. The controversy attracted some celebrity attention. Actor Danny Trejo, one of the faces on the mural, posted a caption that reads in part, amazing mural, check it out before the city removes it. Pro boxer Oscar De La Hoya commented on the artist's Instagram page, Slow Motions, saying, Thank you for the love. I'll make some calls. As of this morning, the petition on change.org had at least 1,500 signatures. Co-owner Renee Cornejo says they're going to ask the city to make an exception. We really wanted something to kind of bring the community together, kind of make Bellflower proud. We wanted to have all the great uh, legends that we feel really represent LA. I did start a petition yesterday. Um, please sign it. <laughs> um, I'm hoping that will show the city if we get enough people that, hey, people love this. Like, come on, you can't make us tear it down. But apparently not everyone loves it. There's been complaints, according to the mayor of Bellflower, who sent us a statement saying, quote, the city does not object to the content of the mural. However, it does not comply with the established mural standards in the municipal code. And we have received complaints about that fact. Our staff is engaged with the owner of the business and we are actively seeking an appropriate solution. Now, the owners of the business tell me that when they started the process of creating this mural, they didn't think it would be a problem because it's on their building on private property. They say they're going through the appeals process and they plan to request a hearing with the city. Reporting live in Bellflower, Kimberly Chang, KTLA 5 News.